Hello everyone who's your first arrivers. Um, welcome to another Cup draw for the PCN. So this draw is going to be a live draw for that first round of the PCN Cup. Um, we'll wait a couple minutes till this notification goes out, but you folks are in here early. Hello. Um, say hi to me and say hi to my co-host tonight, Wayne. Cheers, boys and girls. Welcome to the Cup draw. Hopefully it will be as interesting as the uh, FA Cup draw was a couple days ago on... Uh, over there but excited to get it going see i actually didn't pay attention to that or hear about that because i'm a spurs fan <laughs> mm -hmm. lost to a league two team you mute you muted the words fa cup on twitter until next uh next august i got you it, makes it just it didn't come up in any of my uh spurs news so i literally didn't know it had happened until you just said so well it was uh uh, apologies, I'm sorry. There's English guys in here probably gonna roast, but uh, Chichester City, some you know non-league team got uh, Barry in the draw, so they got a basically a buy, and they got like you know the money is if they won it already. So some non-league team is going through to the second round or something along those. I don't know what round it was to be honest, but. There's a video out on Twitter of them just going bonkers when they see it's them. So yeah, that's interesting that they still had them in there. Well, they had because like it started and they had a play and uh, it was just like a forfeit spot. It wasn't that. I mean, like it's not like anyone they didn't hold anything to that anymore. But it was just like an empty spot because they were in the tournament. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And that's your that's your uh, FA Cup update from PCN. Don't say we don't cover everything in this uh, wonderful league. Yeah. Um, so still waiting for that notification to come out. Um, let's see. Is there any any chat going on yet? Anybody in here? We're just talking to ourselves. We got nine viewers. It looks like. So. Ten. Watch out, folks. Oh wow! Yeah. Um, Starting to get a little nervous. So this is your first time. Um, pretty simple it's like any other cup draw we do so we have the the screen here with all the information and obviously it'll get filled out this bracket will get filled out as the the matchups go you can see the 10 teams here that have buys based upon their finishes last season um it's it is a random draw each round so while as the the, the tournament goes it will look like certain teams like were matched up against each other it's just each round is going to be randomized um kind of like the fa cup as we were just alluding to good word choice alluding yes um so anybody can match up against anybody that's kind of the fun of it um you know last year ac milan we finished third in in super league and, and won a cup and we lost to a league two team and Bayern, your team got what to the quarters semis yeah like a, mag a magical run <laughs> i don't remember exactly how far it was but it was glorious yeah included my uh my only ever recorded pcn official goal it was emotional to say the least but you know shout out to all my byron brothers i hope everyone's doing well over there just you know hope everyone's having a good time yeah i'm trying to play division rivals and it's uh just horrendous mm. one at the back if anyone out there plays one at the back you are perma banned from pcn i'm starting this campaign and if i catch any of you and fut champs playing and with the rb button taped down oh there's gonna be problems yeah um going back to byron real quick um speaking of you know shouting them out they it seems like they had a very interesting match experience with la galaxy the other night which um yeah i still haven't heard the full you guys tried to tell me this the full story and i still couldn't really comprehend it but yeah if if someone from byron or galaxy wants to to drop a a summary of what happened the other night that would be much appreciated because we are still very confused as to what exactly happened um ocho i see you just asked are we drawing it uh we are the notification actually just went out so we'll let everyone click on that, give it another few seconds, and then we'll officially get this thing going. Maybe give it a minute. Let people click on it. All 
All right, welcome. I really ex- what, what, what were we going to say? <laughs> <laughs> I said I really expected to jump to like two or three thousand as soon as that notification went out. I'm pretty disappointed I think here. This to be streamed in like the White House, in uh, you know, in God. little huts across the. Gosh darn it, Dorsey! Yeah, I'm... gosh darn it. <laughs> <laughs> for those of you trickling in, welcome to another live cup draw for PCN. Uh, first round of the League Cup we got going on here tonight. So, got all the information here on the League Cup page. So it's it's the one-legged knockout. It's played every Wednesday night. So, um, you know, 10 teams do get a buy into the second round, the round of 32, based on their finish from last season. That's how the math works out. But basically, it's a random draw all the way through. First game start next Wednesday at 9. So without further ado, let's, let's go ahead and run the draw. So got a randomizer here. We've got the 44 teams that will be going into it here. We will be drawing them one at a time. Once you're drawn, obviously you play the next game that comes out, and then we take you off the list so you don't come up again. Um, pretty basic, I think. Um, it's kind of how we always do it. So let's go ahead and run the draw. First team out is going to be West Ham United. New team in League Two. I think they're about mid table right now, um, doing all right. And they get a they get a tough first matchup against Valencia, who are up there, I think, second place in League One. This is always a good a good opportunity for teams to make statements. You know, the first couple rounds is a uh, you know a minefield, let's say for the, for the uh, you know established teams out there because this is I think the quickest way to kind of get the attention of some people. Yep. Uh, and speaking of top of League One teams, uh, Monaco are also up there in the top three. I don't know who's second or third on top of my head, but I think those two teams are second and third. And they will be getting Atalanta, who are just a little bit further down in League One. But that's a, that's an intriguing League One clash. Very nice. Uh, next out will be New York City. Team still finding their feet in Super League. I believe they're hovering a few spots above the relegation zone currently. And they'll be taken on the Lyon side, which I think are in 7th or 8th. Um, obviously a bit... Bit of a controversial team, but just in some of their, their shit talking. We'll see how they do against New York City. Shots fired. <laughs> well, they've shot enough themselves. They, yeah. Bullets have sh- been sprayed from both sides and in all circumstances there. Yeah. Um, and uh, Glizzy, I just saw your, your comment, thoughts on Lamella today. Lamella kicked ass. I love me some Lamella. He was fantastic. Um, uh, and- objection. Hey, yo, Grizzly, banned, perma banned, no talk on. Well, your team also just got drawn. Uh, Napoli is the next team out, and they will be taking on Frankfurt. So that's a League 2 team playing a struggling League 1 team. So it might be an opportunity for your team to get through there. Next matchup is going to feature another League 1 team. It will be LAFC team also competing for promotion this season, and they will be drawn against Arsenal, the shot, Ooh. the surprising team early on in Super League. Shout out Jaylip, boys over at LAFC. That'll be a good matchup for them. Yeah, I, that's actually that's one of that's definitely my favorite so far. I think a, a team you expect to get promoted potentially from League One and a team that's showing up so far in, in Arsenal and in Super League. But you know, some people are sitting there saying they haven't played anyone, so we'll see what happens when they do. Uh, next up is going to be Bayer Leverkusen. Uh, Darcy and the gang over there struggling a little bit right now, but I think they'll find their feet. And then we'll get a. This is kind of that matchup in the first round where you're like, that's a tough one. It's, a, it's kind of a League Two team figuring things out in 20 going up against Leverkusen. Uh, next up is going to be PSV. I believe they're somewhere around mid table in League Two. Could be wrong on there in their exact positioning, and they'll take on an America team, which I believe are a kind of mid-table League One team. And actually, interesting enough, um, Daddy Akins, the American manager, that's his old squad at PSV. Always fun to get one up on the old squad, right? You know, we'll see who shows up. Oh, I, I see your comment, but you thought I said Lalana. I I didn't want to interrupt you while you're going there, but I got triggered immediately. I had I was, to flash I was like, "You're really that offended by Eric Lamella?" Like, I don't really like. I mean, Lamella's all right. He definitely is better than Lalana. I won't put him in the insta band category for mentioning. <laughs> it. 
Fair enough, fair enough. All right, next up is going to be your League 2 leaders right now, Barcelona. King Frost has that side click in, and there's a chance they could be on tomorrow night's marquee matchup. We'll just have to see. And they'll be taking on Newcastle United, a team promoted from last season. Uh, they did switch over. Uh, the old New Newcastle's at Leipzig. This is last season's Frankfurt. But that's a that's potentially an upset, I think, on the horizon for Barcelona. Another chance to prove themselves. Yeah. Uh, next out's going to be PSG struggling a bit early on. Another another season where Sehai's coming under fire. But of course, you know he's he's been around the block a couple times, and they're going to take on a surprisingly, you know, probably kind of good side so far, I think, in League 2 Marseille. So let's try to avoid the... Yeah, experience manager over there. He knows what he's doing. Yeah. I expect he'll uh, be ready for that. Uh, next out is the Wolfsburg team, which we are currently doing everything we can to find a manager for. Um, had a team in there, found out they really couldn't just make the times as well as they thought they could, unfortunate. And uh, whoever gets in there will have a tough task ahead of them, getting Manchester United. Mmm. Shout out Man United, but that's a uh, a tough draw. Tough draw, you know. Yeah. But we'll see. Yep. Uh, next up is going to be promoted from last season, league from League One into Super League, Borussia Dortmund. I think they're sitting about 14th or so in Super League right now, still trying to figure things out. And they're facing another team that's not had maybe the best of starts, Liverpool. Um, I do expect Liverpool to come out of it, and so it'll be interesting to see who moves on from that matchup. Uh, next up will be an Everton team that I think have, were said last night on the podcast that they've been a little disappointing so far in League 2. Came back with a lot of players from last season and uh, given up a lot of goals. And they'll be facing another League 2 team in Atletico Madrid who are a lot further up the table. So uh, chance for Atletico to move on or chance for Everton to kind of turn their season around. Speaking from experience, you can always take a cup run as a good consolation for a mid-table finish. Exactly, exactly. I mean, last season Atlanta uh, squeaked into the Super Cup, but you know they finished sixth and were able to win the this this cup against a Man City team that I think did finish around eighth or ninth. So that's a very true statement. Um, another darling from last season's PCN Cup, we had Sporting, who I think made it to maybe the round of 16 or the quarterfinals and played a Orlando squad, which they were a little overmatched on, but they had a, they had a pretty decent run, and they'll be taken on Ajax. So another time we have a manager facing their old squad. So Giannis was Sporting's manager. Now he's at Ajax, but he gets his old squad at Sporting. Wow. Can't emotional. <laughs> you can't draw these. We can't fake these things. Giannis, I'm excited. You see your reaction. Uh, <laughs> next matchup will feature the very quiet. No one's ever heard any of their players talk. Seattle Sounders. <laughs> um. Didn't talk at all last night in the podcast. I haven't ever talked in the Discord. And they'll be taking on fellow League One side, Crystal Palace. See if they can keep... The men of mystery, yeah. some might say. Keep their good run running. Um, good run running. Run. Isn't there a song that sounds like run run running? I'm not going there. <laughs> not, not right now. All right. Maybe at 2 a.m. on Rocket League, but... Fair enough. Uh, next match is going to feature <laughs> League One current first place Santa Clara. Very good looking defense over there. And they'll be taking on Inter Miami, who are a little bit further down in the standings at League One. A couple new teams to PCN this season. Mm -hmm. Next matchup is going to have Braga, which is a, a team that had almost got promoted last season and struggling a little bit so far in their second time around in League One. And they'll be taking on a Villarreal team, which are also. Not off to the best start in Super League. So one another chance for teams to kind of get things going. Down to our last six matchups. I believe we have the Leicester City. Um, you know, kind of working into form. Had their had the new team had their first game night the other night and did all right. So I'm looking to see how they do. And they get Tottenham. So we have the 2015-16 real life title race. <laughs> Reenacted. Memories. Great memories. Yeah, great memories as a Spurs fan. Again, you know, just so many things. <laughs> things. But, but uh, you know, and I'm not even going to go there because <laughs> you don't deserve it. Because you're a good <laughs> <laughs> Things have been tough enough. Yes. Uh, next up is going to be Schalke. Um, had a new manager take over last night, so we'll see how they do next week once they've had a week under their belts. 
And they'll be taking on Feyenoord, team in League 2. So, chance for one of the teams to move on and, and maybe make a little bit of a cup run. Next up is Wolves, who have not made any enemies this season in League 1. <laughs> and they'll be taking on last season's kind of bad boys in Bayern Munich. So, a couple, a couple League 1 teams going to add it once again. Shout out Bayern once again. That'll be a good matchup. Yeah, yeah, that's that's one of my favorites so far. Um, next up is going to be Fiorentina. Mash and Cheeks finally got them promoted last season, and they're they're doing all right so far in League One. Um, maybe not scoring quite as many goals as last year, but they take on a Roma team, which are looking for promotion back to League One after a relegation last season. Um, that's kind of a fun matchup too. I think there's some players who played at both those teams. Um, down to our last two, we've got RB Leipzig. Or as I like to call them, RB Leipzig. I don't know if they play a lot of RBYs, but it's a fun thing to say. For you. For me. Well, that's all that matters. And they'll be taking on the Young Boys. Um, Shout out, Young Boys. Good looking team so far. Which means our final matchup will have Porto hosting against Galaxy. So that's your round one of the PCN Cup draw. Um, any matchups stood out to you? Any, any final thoughts before we get out of here? I mean, honestly, that was really fast, and I can't remember them all off the top of my head. But, uh, I mean, I think there's going to be definitely some uh, some good games. And I think the, these are my favorite. This is my favorite cup because it does just have, like, gr- just funny, you know, funny things happen, great upsets. It's uh, some some unexpected shit talking. You know, over the years, it's kind of the same people, right? But then, like, a new team enters the fray. So I, I enjoy it. I so just excited for it. Yeah, yeah, me too. Um, it's a chance for a team for for Super League to you know see play some teams they haven't played before and some League Two guys to get tested, and then you have people playing. Like my favorite too was the America and PSV and the Sporting and IX. You know, two managers who been in League Two for a long time facing their old teams, and then also that Arsenal LAFC one. I think I'm really looking forward to. Yeah, that was it. That, that's going to be a good one for yeah. sure. So um, thanks, everyone, for tuning in. We will be back probably later next week because we'll obviously have the games next Wednesday. So I'm thinking maybe Thursday, Friday, we'll have the draw for the next round. We'll be doing that every week until this cup is over. So uh, thanks, everyone, for tuning in. And um, good luck if you're playing late night tonight. And if not, then uh, we'll see you out there tomorrow night. Cheers, Jeff. Cheers, Jeff.